Oh my gosh, is Chris Chan okay? I'm okay. Oh, okay. I guess he is then. Except, that was a super hard slam, and I feel like he was just trying to play it cool, and he did. I guess he successfully played it cool, but inside, I feel like there might have been a parade of pain going on on his back, because he straight up just got street fightered into that wall. <laughs> Point exact. Ryu freaking showed him how to do it. What? No, I didn't show him how to do it. He did it to him. He did it. He freaking Chris Chan, Chris Chan. It kind of sucks too because when you're skating this ledge, you know it's dangerous. And you're like, all right, okay, worst case scenario, I'm gonna fly backwards into the wall. And then Chris Chan did that. He was the worst case scenario of that uh, equation. All right, math class is out because Chris Chan just landed it. Well, math class. He landed math class. Or he failed it. I don't know which one, but he did something either amazing or horrible. And it kind of sucks this happened to Chris because Chris is just like the nicest dude in the world. He just he's one of the guys. Like if I had to pick a friend, then I was like, I don't want them to fly backwards into a wall. Chris Chan, that was the guy. Everyone else, I'm sorry, you're in for it. But Chris Chan, I don't want that to happen to you. And it did, and it's his fault. It is absolutely Chris' fault because he's trying a back tail around a U-turn curb or ledge or whatever it was. And he, I mean, he did do it, and I'll show you that eventually, but my gosh, that is terrifying. That's like the, the scariest trick. And despite Chris saying it was okay, it was not okay, okay? Look at this still frame. His leg is way higher above his body than it ever needs to be. And just look at the face. Look at that face. It's not a happy one. I, I couldn't even recreate that face. Andy, show me a face where you're flying backwards and you slam into a concrete wall. I couldn't even recreate it. Try, I'd be like, that'd probably be it. But Chris Chan makes it believable. He's a better, he doesn't have to act because it happened to him. When I was uh, sitting down to film this video, I realized that I've never actually seen Chris Chan slam like that, which makes it more disturbing. Like, you know, the nice guy thing, like Chris is a, just a genuine nice dude. I don't want him to fall. And I was like, oh wait, he doesn't fall at all. Uh, even the fall Friday that he was in before this, it was just like a scary moment. He didn't even like get hurt. And that should tell you how good Chris Chan is at skateboarding. One of the most talented dudes I've, I've witnessed skateboard in real life. He's very, very good. And uh, it's weird to see him fall. Of course, when he does, he does it like a freaking wrestling move. He got freaking WCW versus NWO'd into that wall. Chris was, of course, okay. He uh, got up and kept skating it. It was would be a weird thing to shake because after that fall, I would be super weirded out. And I really like green screening falls. I'm gonna, let's see if I can do some more creative green screen attacks on Chris to make this fall happen. Get over! Gotcha. Ha! Sorry, Chris Chan. I just beat you up via video game. But I will show you some clips. Uh, I will show you the back tail that he actually landed uh, to regular and fakie, and I'll throw some clips that I filmed of Chris in the past. Um, so enjoy this. Chris Chan is amazing to watch on a skateboard. So there you guys go, I hope you enjoyed the skateboarding and the me ranting about Chris's fall. Uh, if you want to see more from Chris, click the link right down there. Uh, Chris is an awesome dude and he, like I said, he normally doesn't fall. He's usually landing amazing tricks. He has really good content here on YouTube, you probably already know him. But uh, if you don't, go enjoy his channel, it's really, really good. But that is it, I hope you guys dug this, this is Fall Friday. Uh, I try to do these every other week, but sometimes I, I skip a few weeks because I don't have a fall. But uh, I'll be back regardless, and I do daily videos. So if, if you want to see more from me, click the top link, or wherever, no, not the link, but just click wherever it is on the screen that says subscribe. Either way, I am done, I'm gonna put Ryan Chambers in the hot seat. Has it been a while for you being in the hot seat? It has been. Or were you the last one? You weren't the last one, were you? No. It's been a while that there's been a hot seat, so sit down. Uh, hi, Ryan Chambers. Hi. How are you doing today? Good, how are you? I'm doing good, thank you. Ryan's face is right next to you. Okay, it is midnight, and a craving for food hits. What's the first food that you go to? Uh, Mustard-covered sardines. Uh, mustard covered sardines. That's Brian Ames. He would, he would love that probably. <laughs> he probably would actually. <laughs>